Greetings, this is Ginthian, and today we are playing on the Demiurge server on Minecraft 1.18.2. Today I want to build a shop. I think it'll be kind of obvious once I build it what it sells. So let's go create the location and then build the shop. Now I had this grand idea of building this circle and filling up the land with sand so that I could then use coral. And that way it would be nice and bright and shiny and that let's just say that ran into problems. But that didn't stop me from trying. We go in and we're going to fill in this whole area with sand. I actually gathered other places. We fill the whole thing in. And then I start laying out the coral. And no sooner do I do that, does it start dying. So I go two water deep. And that doesn't work either. The coral still dies. Now I've killed most of the coral and decide that it looks pretty cool the pattern looks good it would be a good gray pattern that would work well i also discovered that the coral dying changed the water so now the water is flowing which means it's making noise so i have to go back in and fill it back in again with land sand again and then I can go ahead and fill in the coral. And then I come to the realization that I have run out of coral. I don't have enough coral. So that leads me to the next idea, which is to alternate it. And I can come up with a nice pattern to alternate the coral and the polished diorite. I really like the way this pattern turns out. My first attempt, I decide to build each stripe four blocks tall. I don't think four blocks tall is the right thickness for the stripes, so I change it to three and continue the spiral on around. Does anyone not know what I'm making? It is really easy to lose your place, so some things have to be done more than once. I tried the do the roof and it failed, so this is my better re my better my second attempt. And unlike Mir and Roscoe, I actually am doing the interior of the building. Yes, that's a jab. And that finishes up the inside. Now let's just do the outside. Put these flames on pillars and I think I will be done and happy with this design. And there you have it, my first shop. Okay, it's been a few days, and I want to see what has happened. Let's see if there are any sales. Just go up and check. Not a very easy staircase to get up. <laughs> well, that seems fair. <laughs> I said each of them were worth a diamond, and uh, these were the IOUs I used, so it looks like I have indeed made sales. That's hilarious. Okay, <laughs> Let, let's go. I feel like I should explain that a little better. I gave IOUs to Mir for the different books that I needed. 
and I gave him a bunch of IOUs, one for each book. And each IOU ended up being worth a diamond, because that's what he decided to sell his books for. And I just got my IOUs back to buy rockets, which is what I found so funny. So that's the explanation. Now, let's get back to work. As I'm starting to make this walk more and more often, I need to, to build this bridge. I got tired of going through the ravine, which is exactly what bridges are for. And here's a look of what it looks like now. It still needs a few more lights. So I'll have to light up the rest. But there you have it. And I am fixing my equipment. This is the skeleton spawner that I found. Probably haven't shown it to you before, but I set it up at least so that I could get some XP. And I am going to call this video. We got a lot accomplished today. Even though the video turned out to be a little shorter than normal. As always, thank you for watching. And goodbye. I'll just leave you watching the skeleton.